Talo falava malo for. Welcome to the end of week five. It's been a great week at Tower School. We've had a number of our amazing students acting as leaders and teaching many of our tamariki about Samoan language. So a big thank you to all those students who have been sharing their Samoan culture as part of this week. And it's been great to hear Samoan language happening around the school as well. So that's fantastic. I do want to say a big thank you to our school community for your support and our transition back to wearing masks in our year four to eight classes. Our tamariki have coped really well. Um, it's been actually quite a natural transition and it really is about ensuring that we um, stop or slow down a, um, a second wave of COVID cases. Now, even though COVID may be mild, I know that there are for some, like myself, who are experiencing some long-term, uh, long, long, longer lasting effects of this. So please make sure that you're looking out for yourselves um, and uh, we'll keep you updated with how that is all tracking. As I have mentioned before, uh, Lynette Parkin is our new board presiding member and she has shared a message with us so you can check that out right now. Kia ora Tower School Fano. it's my pleasure to come in here and introduce myself and speak on behalf of the board. I'm Lynette Parkin, board chair and presiding member. I'm joined on the board by Nick and Jenny in their role as trustees. Karen is our Montessori rep, Nicole is our Fano rep, Robin is our staff rep, Barry in his role as principal, and we're also supported by Trina as our board secretary. I'd first like to take this opportunity to thank Barry and our entire school staff for their ongoing hard work and dedication to our tamariki. Uh, on a daily basis, you're striving to make our school what it is, a thriving, caring and safe learning community for our tamariki. I'd also like to take this opportunity to thank you as our parents and Fano for your ongoing support of the school and of our tamariki. It's the support that makes our school a success. Now I know the last couple of years have been hard for us. It's been a tough ride for parents and staff alike. We've learned a lot along the way. I know I've learned a lot personally and as a parent, as an individual, I know a lot of you will have as well. We've also learned a lot as a school. We're continuing to do so. Uh, your feedback and thoughts are welcome all the time, uh, but we're learning together and we're hoping to continue to do that. Communication with our school funnel is incredibly important to us. So please make sure you're reaching out to your child's teacher, having a chat to them, asking questions and sharing your child's learning journey together. You all have seen in the news that last week that Barry mentioned we've got board elections coming up in August. We're looking for three new team members. If this is something that interests you or you're just interested in finding out a little bit more about what we do on the board, please feel free to reach out to Barry or to myself and we'd be happy to have a chat. Lastly, on behalf of the board, I just want to wish you all a happy and safe end to your week and hopefully some well-deserved downtime with your tamariki this weekend. Take care. As we move into the second half of the term, you'll start to notice reporting posts coming through on Seesaw. This will indicate how your child is going within literacy, maths, there'll be a general comment and a curriculum level um, information provided at the very end of the term. On the very last day of term, uh, that'll be the 8th of July, we are holding our parent-teacher interviews. So uh, keep an eye out for when you can book those. That'll also be on the Thursday afternoon slash evening as well. So reporting stuff is starting to come out. If you've got any questions, feel free to send your uh, teacher an email or a message via Seesaw if you want any clarification on that. And of course, there'll be the interview time to discuss where your child is going in their learning as well. So it's a long weekend this week. And it's Queen's birthday, so please don't turn up to school on Monday because I certainly won't be here and none of our team will. Hey, have a great weekend. Enjoy having time together with your family and uh, we'll catch up with you ready for the start of week six. Tofa soi fua.